Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are having a great day today. I am really, really excited because I'm gonna be doing a clean with me. The exciting part of today's video is today's video is in partnership with LG. You guys remember last year I did a video with LG and in that collaboration, LG gave away 20 vacuums. I know there was another YouTuber that they work with which made 40 and I know there was more, but I know in particular the other YouTuber. So what they wanted was for you guys to be able to use the vacuum, love the vacuum, and then of course give your honest review on it, kind of like how I'm doing today. And a lot of you guys responded back to me saying the vacuum was amazing. I agree with you. The vacuum is amazing. So when they reached back out to me about the new one, I was like, well, how could it get any better, <laughs> right? But it did, and I so love it. So one thing that hasn't changed about the vacuum is the sleekness. It's super lightweight in comparison to another cordless that I had in the past, and the suction on it is amazing, the same as the last time. Some of the things I have changed on it, which I personally love, is this right here, which is a little small chamber. As I'm cleaning today, you guys will get to see it in action. So pretty much before, I would have to open this, allow the trash to go out, and every so often, I may have to kind of stick my finger in there to clean it out. But they've added this small little lever right here, which actually pushes the trash down. So I think they actually heard the concerns and made those tweaks. This vacuum also comes with the two batteries. I know another vacuum company did the whole two battery things. I know, but I'm just gonna say this one thing and we ain't gonna argue about it. LG was first. <laughs> but anyway, instead of me going on and on about how great this vacuum is, let me go ahead and allow you to see how I vacuum. And as I'm cleaning with it, I will go over some of the components of the vacuum. So I just purchased a new rug, you guys, which I will be sharing with you in another video. But before I put the rug down, I wanted to go ahead and vacuum really quick. Upstairs had so much stuff. I had swept and also vacuumed previously, so I know the floors weren't like too crazy, but it definitely, definitely got a little dusty with all of the construction going on in the house. So of course I wanted to vacuum it, which meant I had to open up my new vacuum. And oh my gosh, I just love the smell of a new vacuum. I love the smell of anything new. But since we're on the topic of vacuums, I love the smell of the new vacuum. There's definitely a lot of things that I love about the LG Cordero, but one of the things that I do like is the fact that I can open up the dust compartment or dirt compartment and I can remove that filter out, rinse it, wipe it down, allow it to dry overnight and that way I can reuse it. I don't have to worry about changing, buying or replacing anything within the vacuum itself. In terms of putting it together, it is really, really easy. It was easy with the very first one that I got and because I put the first one together, this one came together like really easy. I am going to mount this again towards the end of the video. You guys will see how I store and house the vacuum. I did have my electrician add extra cords around the house so I can have my vacuums readily available to me when I was ready to clean. So I will be sharing that with you also. So as I'm taking everything out of the box, you can definitely see all the components. There is the vacuum for your hardwood floors and also the carpet. You have the furniture cleaner. You have the small brushes and a small angle brush. That way you can get into the corners of everything. I love this because it goes from an upright to a handheld vacuum really easy. Now that I'm done taking everything out of the box, what I'm gonna do is go ahead and vacuum my hardwood floors, you guys. And then I'm gonna go ahead and vacuum my rug. The first thing I'm gonna be doing is turning on the power button. There is a turbo option, but because the floors really aren't that dirty, I'm not gonna use that. But if you're dealing with a much heavier mess, feel free to turn that one on. That way you get a lot more suction in the vacuum. But keep in mind, this also lessens your vacuum time when you use it on the turbo option. Using the vacuum out of the regular setting for me really helps overall in cleaning the floor and doing everything. What I'm showing you are just the areas that are a little bit dirty than the others so you can actually see all of the dust and everything else in the little cracks and stuff really get picked up. But now that I'm done with the flooring, what I'm going to do is roll out the rug. I have a haul coming. I'm not sure if it's going to drop before or after this video. If you have, if this is your first time, 
I'm seeing the rug, the nine six out of 10, I haven't dropped it yet. And if you're seeing it, then I hope you enjoyed the video. But this is what the room is looking like and this is what the rug is looking like. And you guys, I really do love everything overall. I found this rug on a steal over the weekend while I was shopping. <laughs> So now that I'm done with the loft, I'm gonna go ahead and move into my master bedroom. Now I recorded this part a couple days ago because I went through an entire day of purging and also donating items in the house. Pretty much like I mentioned to you guys a few videos ago, I went through all of my fragrances, my jewelry, and also my jeans. I got rid of about 21 pair of jeans. Also, maybe anywhere from about five to six bottles of perfumes. Everything is still really good in great condition. I'm gonna do a giveaway once all the purging is done. But right now what I'm doing is the jeans that I'm keeping, I'm putting them on a hanger. I will be leaving the hanger down below. I know you guys are interested in that. But once I get them on the hanger, I am transferring them from out of the master bedroom into my closet. Ta-da! <laughs> For those of you guys that haven't seen my closet, this is what my closet currently looks like. I am almost done. There's still quite a bit of work that's left to be done in this space, but I am so happy that at least the flooring, the paint, and shelvings and stuff is pretty much in the room. The only thing that's left again is just really a lot of like placement and organizing and making sure that I am using the space to the max of visibility. But what I'm doing currently is wiping down all of the shelvings. I did put it in there a few days ago, which you guys saw. And now I'm going to start placing everything. As I am cleaning, I'm also looking and making adjustments. When I originally hung everything, I just hung without anything really in mind. And then, of course, once I start implementing things into the space, I can see what's going to work and what's not going to work for me. And I'm also making those changes along the way as I put everything together. So right now, I'm going to be putting everything back in their proper place once i am done with all of the cleaning and organizing i'm going to be going in with my lg vacuum you guys are going to get to see how i use the different attachment heads hey i don't get what this is about you got my head spinning on my shoulders i feel a burn inside of my chest see the lines that stay blurred Things that I kept, like, I feel like I would really get a good wear out of them. 
everything that was going to go into my closet, I have placed them in my closet. I try to limit myself on how much I'm going to do so that way I don't overexert myself and tire myself out too much. So at least I have a little bit of energy by the end of the night. But now that I'm done with all of that, I'm just going to vacuum a little bit again. I'm going in with the LG. I really do love the vacuum, you guys. It's so quiet. It's a lot quieter than my other vacuum that I had in the past from another company. And it's super lightweight and easy to handle. I really, really love it. It makes vacuuming so easy. And I'm going to go ahead and just move things around in the room. That way I can get a really good vacuuming in. If you guys are interested in the rug, which I actually voted on Instagram. And a lot of you guys did not pick this rug. But I love this rug. And now that the room is done, you can kind of see it in the space. Now that I'm done with the floors though, I decided to go ahead and remove the extension along with that head off. And I am using the new vacuum head, you guys. Now this one here actually as a massager on your furniture that way if you have pets or anything that's pretty much on your furniture it beats it up kind of like how you would do when you're like doing a rug and then it suctions up as that piece right there is vacuuming on the furniture you can definitely see how much dirt i picked up just vacuuming the loft in my closet this is the new vacuum and i'm showing you how the lever works which again i'm so happy that they tweaked the vacuum with this it is making things so much easier now that i'm done i'm going to go ahead and move into my master bedroom i'm sure you guys already see some familiar things i did take a few things out of the old house not everything but definitely a few things one of those things being my mirror in the day bed which i'm currently cleaning the mirror now if you guys are interested i will be leaving the link in the description box down below but now that i'm done with the mirror i'm moving into the master closet which is pretty much where i'm going to be housing my vacuum so here's the hanging that's going to be draped against the wall here you guys and then the plug back here on this wall and then here goes the vacuum so when I open my door, my vacuum is right here in my master so I can clean and do everything. I am so happy about this. So now that I'm done with hooking up the vacuum into the closet, what I'm going to do is focus on vacuuming the master bath and also the bedroom and of course vacuuming all the other items in the room. One of those loose dreams. In one of those loose dreams. I love a lot of things about the LG vacuum, but again, what I'm really loving is the attachment heads, especially the one that I'm currently changing to, which is for your furniture. Now, this day bed is from Overstock. Let me just tell y'all, the tufting in this day bed is extremely, extremely deep. I actually did this in the previous house, but I'm sharing it with you in this video. So if you have a bed or a sofa or like me, you have a day bed and you have little ones and sometimes the little crumbs get in there. I remove the attachment head and I just take the round little piece up top and I put it around the buttons in the tuft. It really helps to take everything out. It may not seem like it's doing much, but you guys, the suction power on it is amazing and just isolating the air into that one little section really helps to get all the little dust particles and lint and again crumbs from around it and it's just like so so clean. I don't know if you can see like the microfiber little lint just kind of climbing up in there but I do my best to clean, wipe and also sanitize my furniture. Maybe one of these days I'll share that process with you guys. If you've been here long enough, then you already know some of the products that I use. But being able to vacuum my furniture is really, really important to me because I like my things to look really, really nice. So LG is definitely helping me keep all my things looking brand spanking new. My head is dancing like the purple haze. I don't know where we're going, but the clues that you are throwing are leading me back home. I'm done with 
with my master. I'm going to go ahead and move into the loft and finish off the video in there. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. If you don't already, you should definitely try the vacuum out because it really is amazing. All right, you guys, that is it for the video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. Try to give you guys a little sneak peek of things here and there while I was cleaning today. I am so excited. Part of the reason is because I love my vacuum. It is absolutely amazing. I didn't even think the vacuum can get any better than the first one. The second edition is absolutely amazing. All the information that you guys might be interested in, I will leave in the description box down below for you. Number two, you guys know how much I have, you know, maybe not so much cried because I'm not going to come on camera, you know, too many times crying, but it was a quite an emotional roller coaster trying to get my closet together, which I'm currently sitting in, trying to, you know, finalize things for the floor, the trim. It, it really was a lot. I knew what I wanted and I knew it was going to be a lot, but I had no idea exactly, exactly what I was embarking on when I said I was going to be on this journey of uh, turning my building grade into a custom home. It's been a lot, but... I am seeing the light at the end of the tunnel, you guys. To see my loft like emptied out and all the stuff in there, I've been decluttering, I've been um, purging, throwing things out, like going through everything. I've really condensed, as you can see, like my perfume collection, I've condensed that down. My jewelry collection, I've condensed, like I'm really just trying. I don't wanna be a minimalist. I really don't wanna do that. But I'm realizing that I am but one person and I don't need so much stuff. It was hard, I'm not going to lie. But um, I really had to kind of dig deep inside and be like, listen, like enough is enough. You know what I'm saying? So I hope you guys enjoyed the little small sneaks here and there, like I said. And again, thank you so very much to LG. Again, as you can see, I got my LG TV. I got my LG phone on the way, coming in the mail. I'm so excited. Um, previous to this video, I've always been a fan of LG. My mom has LG TVs and stuff, and she's always spoke highly of them. When I got the collaboration last year, I was just like so elated about the 20 vacuum giveaway you know what I'm saying? i was like oh my gosh this is so amazing <laughs> definitely if you guys enjoyed today's video thumbs up and also leave a comment for me and if you're not already feel free to subscribe i'll see you guys next time bye